In this video we're going to demonstrate how to do an interrupted suture. Um, what we've got some scissors that you can see up there, some two forceps which you can see here, our needle holder and there's a curved needle that you can see sitting in it. Uh, here's our wound with some half centimetre markers and we're going to aim to do um, a suture uh, approximately every centimetre. Um, we're going to pop the needle in at 90 degrees of the skin, so perpendicular, coming out into the middle of the wound, using the curve of the needle to go through the wound, uh, and just driving that needle through as opposed to pulling it through. Then picking it up, coming out the other side, again same thing, so try and pick it up roughly where you want to use it, and then pulling that needle through safely uh, without um, poking your needle uh, in your assistant's eye. Then we're going to do a hand tie, which is just going to be done in the standard way. And then we're going to use our scissors to cut the thread at about a centimetre. Okay. Now we're going to do that again. Um, roughly a centimetre away, and this time demonstrate how to do an instrument tie. So we're going to come into the wind, approximately perpendicular, again using the curve of the needle, same thing coming out the other side, using the curve of the needle, you can see I'm using my left hand to manipulate the wound to make that easier for me. This time we're going to demonstrate how to do needle tie. So we can see our short thread there, our long thread here. We're going to go one, two, in an upwards direction, pulling the short thread down and through. Then one, this time pulling the short thread up. One again, and this time pulling the short thread down. Same again, using our scissors to cut the thread about a centimetre so they can be removed at a later point.